learning to brew your own coffee is usually a rite of passage on any college campus. You guys have like a coffee lab. But at UC Davis in California, Java isn't just a percolating prerequisite. The design of coffee is a full-on engineering elective filtering through more than 2,000 undergraduate students every year. The water moves through the coffee grounds as a function of how hard you push on it. It all started when professors Bill Riston and Tanya Cool wanted to bring hands-on lab work to chemical engineering students. You guys are ruining coffee for me already, I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> and that jolted an entire course. Coffee was a mechanism where they could do experiments with chemical engineering in a safe way. How popular is this class? A few years ago, the student newspaper ran a survey. A three was introduction to beer burn. Number two was introduction to human sexuality. Number one was coffee. Wait a minute. Yeah. Wait a minute. Be you guys beat beer? You guys beat we sex beat beer. ed? Yeah, at UC Davis, coffee is more popular than beer and sex. <laughs> that smells delicious. It's black. I usually don't drink coffee black. It's going to have a little more hint of a bitterness to it. Wow. Look at this, look at this, look at this. Look at this. Oh, goosebumps. This is a uh, blend of coffee from Peru and Timor Leste. Tim Stachinsky is the head roaster at the new state-of-the-art coffee research lab. And he explained, while eyes are deceiving, the best roasters rely on smell and sound. Take a listen to this. Popcorn. It sounds like, it sounds like popcorn. That's right, that first crack is the cornerstone of how any of us take our coffee. You know light to dark roasts? Well, anything right after that first little chemical explosion of a coffee bean is considered light and medium as the roasting timer keeps running up until you hear a second crack. Then you're entering dark roast territory. Coffee seems simple. You know, it's like, how hard is it to pour hot water over a brown powder? But once you get in the details, like very minor changes in how you roast it, how you brew it, have a tremendous impact on the flavor of the coffee. It sounds like all your courses, it's everything from history of the world to culture to like thermodynamics to chemical engineering, all of it in, in a cup of coffee. And those finer details of roasting have proven to be a perfect playground for engineers. <laughs> this is the assignment of the day, huh? Yes. Cheers. Perfect for a morning class. I win-win, right? Oh, that's an A, guys. Yeah. That's, a, that's an A over here. Wow. Wait, so what did you guys write down on this one? Sensory evaluations. Disgusting, really burnt, and bitter. What, do I want to taste a bad one? OK, let's do it. Bottoms up. This is bad coffee right here. Scientifically proven to be bad coffee. Wow, good job with the bad coffee. The so best cup of coffee I've ever had in my life was in this class, they came in, they, the TA called me over and said, you gotta taste this. And I was astonished. I said, like, what, what did you guys do? How did you make this? And like, they had this like, like very frantic conversation. They were like looking through all their notes and they said, professor, sorry, we didn't write it down. No, <laughs> no. So, Which means the recipe for the perfect cup of coffee is still waiting to be found. And hopefully this time, someone will write it down. To the future of coffee. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, that's... That coffee center runs entirely on donations from major coffee companies who say they are investing in the brilliant minds of the future uh, coffee scientists there. And while you saw the head roaster, Tim, and I cooking something up, we were cooking up this batch, a special limited edition Today Show blend. I sent some over for you guys. Yeah, okay. You have it right there. Oh, I saw a hand Wait, so this is it, the one so... you made? Oh, that's it, nice. This is the batch that we mixed up. Yeah, let me Ooh, let me know what what this is great great I get on my very final. mellow. That's it is. that's very smooth. Yeah, kind of like it you got it. Very like you smooth. Brother. Okay, so what do you think? Like a B, an A? No, I'm yeah, this is an A. Man, that, that is really good. It, this is actually Terrific. really good coffee. Well mm. done. How like how frantic were you after this? <laughs> doing this, like how jittery were you after <laughs> doing this shoot? <laughs> Oh, my God. I had, like, six cups of that coffee. That coffee was so good. It really, I mean, it hit the back of your, your mouth and the front of your mouth. And then as soon as it went down, I, I, this coffee is good, the one that we made here. But yeah. the one that I had there, there was, like, no aftertaste. So you were chasing the taste with every sip. And needless to say, like, six cups of coffee, I was very caffeinated. <laughs> well, done. Well, well done. Well done, Gotti. Well done, UC Davis. 
Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.